Cadillac has just revealed the 2024 Escalade IQ. It is a $130,000 flagship electric SUV with a 450-mile range. It has 750 horsepower, a 55-inch display, and an executive rear seating package with stowable tray tables. The sleek styling is for more than just looks as aerodynamics play an important role when it comes to range and efficiency. As a result, designers work tirelessly to lower the coefficient of drag by approximately 15%. That's a sizable reduction and it was made possible by giving the Escalade IQ a smooth underbody. An active lower intake and aerodynamically optimized 24-inch wheels. Buyers will also find flush side glass, angular lines, and a fixed glass roof with a UV filtering film that promises to keep the cabin comfortable. While the Larica shoes a frunk, the Escalade IQ has an e-trunk that opens to reveal a carpeted compartment with 12.2 cubic feet, 345 liters of storage space. The compartment also has a power port as well as a Cadillac crest on the bottom of the hood. Customers can get a power open and close entry system, which enables all four doors to be operated at the touch of a button. The system can even automatically open the driver's door when the owner approaches the vehicle. The model measures 224.3 inches, 5,697 millimeters, long, 94.1 inches, 2,389 millimeters, wide, and 76.1 inches, 1,934 millimeters, tall with a wheelbase that spans 136.2 inches, 3,460 millimeters. To put those numbers into perspective, the model is 2.7 inches, 69 millimeters, shorter than the Escalade ESV despite having a 2.1 inch, 53 millimeters, longer wheelbase. The cabin is heavily inspired by the ultra-luxury Celestique and features a 55-inch curved display with speakers that function as end caps. Roughly 35 inches are dedicated to the driver and this includes a central infotainment system with Google built-in. This provides access to Google Maps, Google Assistant, and the Google Play Store where owners can download their favorite apps. There's an 11-inch front command center that appears to be focused on climate controls and vehicle settings. It's joined by an elegant controller and a wireless smartphone charger. Owners who get chauffeured around will want to opt for the executive second-row seating package, which features a center console as well as individual seats with heating, ventilation, and massage functions. Other highlights include two 12.6-inch displays, a rear command center, and stowable tray tables. The package also includes a dual wireless smartphone charger as well as USB-C and HDMI ports. There's a new two-spoke steering wheel and laser-etched wood trim with available illumination. A 19-speaker AKG Studio Audio System comes standard, while Level 2 feet trims come with a 36-speaker AKG Studio Reference System. The aforementioned executive second-row seating package boosts the speaker count to 40 thanks to speakers mounted in the rear headrests. The power-folding third row only offers 30.1 inches, 765 mm, of legroom and it looked like a tight fit. The standard Escalade has 34.9 inches, 886 mm, of room. While the Escalade ESV boasts 36.6 inches, 930 mm of third-row legroom. Cargo volume also trails the ice-powered models as there are 23.7 cubic feet, 670 liters, of storage space behind the third row and 69.1 cubic feet, 1,958 liters, behind the second row. With the second and third rows folded, there are 119.2 cubic feet, 3,374 liters, of luggage room. The Escalade IQ will come standard with a hands-free semi-autonomous driving system that works on more than 400,000 miles, 643,738 kilometers, of compatible roadway in the United States and Canada. The crossover will also come with a host of other driver assistance systems including blind zone steering assist, intersection automatic emergency braking, front pedestrian and bicyclist braking, and an HD surround vision camera system. Buyers will also find an enhanced automatic parking assist system, which can automatically steer, brake and shift gears to park the vehicle into a dedicated parallel or perpendicular parking space. The Escalade IQ has a 24-module battery pack with a capacity of 200 kWh, which will enable the model to have a range of approximately 450 miles The dual-motor all-wheel drive system produces a combined output of 680 horsepower, 507 kilowatts, 689 PS, and 615 pound-feet, 834 newton meters of torque. That climbs to 750 horsepower, 559 kilowatts, 760 PS, and 785 pound-feet, 1,063 newton meters, in velocity max mode. The Escalade IQ can rocket from 0 to 60 miles per hour, 0 minus 96 kilometers per hour, in less than 5 seconds.
The model can also tow up to 8,000 pounds, 3,629 kilogram. The Escalade IQ rides on the Ultium platform and features magnetic ride control 4.0 as well as an adaptive air ride suspension. The latter enables the vehicle to be raised 1 inch, 25 millimeters, or lowered up to 2 inches, 50 millimeters. Speaking of which, there's a low ride mode that enables the SUV to be driven at low speeds with the suspension fully lowered. Four-wheel steer comes standard and is far more practical as it enables the rear wheels to turn in the same or opposite direction as the front wheels. This significantly improves low-speed maneuverability and Cadillac said the Escalade IQ has a turning circle of 39.4 feet, 12 meters. The Escalade IQ will be offered with an arrival mode, which is the brand's take on crab mode. It enables the model to be driven diagonally, making it easier when pulling into or out of tight spaces. The 2025 Cadillac Escalade IQ will be billed at factory zero and pricing will start around $130,000. While the final numbers will be announced closer to launch, it's a significant hike over the 2023 Escalade that begins at $80,795. However, the EV offers performance on par with the Escalade V-Series and that model costs more than $150,000.